in the beginning of the vlog too much because I look like crap and I haven't showered. But good morning. I am going to start this video off with a bath for Edison. And this is really the first time that I've used my new memory card from a few, like a month ago. I have not vlogged. Um, if you guys saw my last video, you will know that I just needed to take some time for myself. Um, I can't, I can't really talk too much about everything that's going on because it includes more than me. So, um, for personal reasons and stuff. But anyways, um, it's been nice. I've needed it and I finally feel the urge to pick up the camera again. So I want to take advantage of this moment. Um, <laughs> of all the days that I could be filming, of course. But uh, I want to take you guys along on this weekend. I've got a fun few things planned and I just want to vlog. So first thing is going to be a bath for us. I'm planning on ordering some CBD oil this weekend for him, for his chin. He... Hey! Don't eat your own hair. Sit down. Sit down. He's going back to the vet on Friday, whatever that date is, the 22nd or something, um, just for an update on his rabies shot. But he... Uh, ended his prescription, I would say like two weeks ago now, and I called the doctor and I told them that it really didn't clear it up. So instead of, sit down, stay, instead of having them put him on something else, I've been researching CBD oil, all right, I can't talk right now, I'll tell you later, <laughs> sit, stay. Not a toy. Good boy. Good boy. Stay. Good boy. Stay. No. No. Not that much to be honest, but we'll get the rust off in the bath. Go side. Go side. <laughs> 
You look so handsome, baby. You look so handsome. Yes. You feel better? You feel better? Yeah. You feel better? Mommy's got to take a shower now. Okay. That did not even record. But um, it is a super special morning. I'm... Um, heading in to get my hair cut right now and the last time I got it cut was seriously a year and a half ago when I first started YouTube. It was literally one of the first videos that I uploaded on here and surprisingly it's like the second ranked video out of all of my videos I've ever done which sucks because it's like the worst editing I've ever done but whatever. Um, and so yeah, this is what it looks like now. It's really not that bad, but it definitely needs some life back into it. Oh my god, oh my god, I need to start curling my hair. <laughs> I didn't want to add layers or anything because I'm trying to grow it out and have it one length. I explained to her, I was like, my hair is so thick and heavy that it feels like it always is falling in my face and I don't want bangs um, and I don't want really any layers done so I didn't know if there was something I should do if I should just be using more styling product because I don't really use a lot I don't really like the feeling of it I feel like it makes my hair feel thicker than it already is she suggested maybe throwing some loose curls in it and that'll probably help you know which makes sense um, it kind of like intertwines with it and brushes it away from my face um, we tried it and I need to start doing this more because it seriously Oh, it's so nice and it feels so healthy. The ends were getting so straggly. Oh, I love it. 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 Um, if you live in the area, she is great at hair. She's awesome to go to. I feel like I don't feel forced to talk when I'm there and I can just like enjoy the experience. So I just love her. She's awesome. And, um, yeah. I can't stop looking at it. Oh, it looks so good. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. I just grabbed some Chipotle. For anybody that's gluten-free that, I guess, kind of still eats out, um, I haven't fully... There's still certain places that I eat. So, anyways, um, just a tip. If you get there right when they open, everything on the line is perfectly fresh, hasn't been touched, so... They just open and that makes it so much easier. Chipotle is already pretty good about it. They will pull from the back of the line for any toppings that you're wanting. But if you get there right when they open, you're the first customer, which happened to work out today, then it's perfect. So it makes life a lot easier for me and for them. Drawers, 
So before I go to dinner, which is the next thing I have planned for this weekend, I just wanted to do a quick little outfit of the day. I don't have a mirror, a stand-up, or a full body mirror anywhere in the house. So actually, no, we did. I don't know where it went. But all of this is from TJ Maxx. I don't know if they still carry these particular items on their websites, but um, I did just get them and I think I'm going to end up wearing these pants tomorrow to the concert. Um, I'm not sure yet, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up wearing them again. I really like them. They're so comfortable. So these pants are the brand Cloth and Stone. They are in a size extra small. If they had a small, I probably would have went with the small, but they didn't. And these were on sale for $29.99. It's a little bit more than I normally spend on pants, but I really, really like these and I don't have anything like them already. So um, they're kind of like a high-waisted and this is a crop top, so I figured it looks really good paired together. I don't like a lot of like my belly hanging out. So um, the next, let me take this one off. The next piece, it's kind of hard to see in the lighting here. Hold on, let me see if I can fix it. Okay, that's a little bit better. This is just a green crop top. Uh, with it being St. Patrick's Day, it's for my friend's birthday. I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram or not, but you would have seen the post and she just wanted everybody to wear green. So this is like a hunter green. The brand of this is Live in the Moment. It's a size large. I don't normally wear that size, but for this, I like that. I can't imagine what the small would fit like. It would be way too tight. I just like how it kind of hangs pretty loose. Um, and then I also have a cardigan that I think I'm going to end up either bringing or wearing. Um, let me grab that. I should have said that the top was $6. So the pants were $30, $29.99. The top was $6. And then this was also on sale for $10. And I'm like obsessed with this cardigan. I don't know if you can tell on camera. It kind of looks like it's rough, but it's actually pretty comfortable. What is it made out of? It is 85% acrylic and 15% poly polyamide. Um, it's like a different texture, but it's not rough. So this is by the brand Hippie Rose in a size small. I'll try it on for you guys so you can see what it looks like on. But I really, really like it. So it's cute. It's kind of hard to see myself in the lens, but um, it's really comfy and I like the big buttons on it. And I really liked how it's not only like baggy in the arms, but then it's also kind of like that cuffed scrunchie at the base there. So it's just really cute. And basically goes with everything. So don't know yet what I want to wear on my feet. These are scrunchy at the bottom. I do have a pair that might look good. I'm about to try those on right now. I don't know because this outfit is not really that fancy and I feel like these are a little bit fancy on the fancier side, both of these. Um, but I think these might look the cutest. They are an open toe and my nails don't look the greatest. So I don't know and it's still winter here in New York so I don't know if I'm brave enough to wear these. Yeah, no, no, these look really bad. Um, you can't really even see my toes, so that's not what I mean by they look bad, but you can tell. Um, see that? I don't know. They just look... I don't know. I don't think they're a good fit, and they don't come up as high as I was hoping. So here's the second pair. I don't know what I think of them, but these ones. Oh, <laughs> you can't even see it. These are bad, except for my skin is like ghostly white underneath them. I do have, they're kind of dirty. I do have something like this. Way more casual.
These are kind of cute. I think I kind of like these. Hmm. I think maybe these tonight, if I can clean them up a little bit before I go, and then the heels tomorrow. Let me see. I do have a pair of moccasins that might look cute. Or even those green shoes. These look cute too. These look really cute with the bottom. Oh, no. That looks really funny next to that shoe, but. Eh. I don't know. These ones are green. More green for St. Patrick's Day, but. Um, we're going for sushi. We're not going anywhere crazy fancy, but. It's newly renovated and I have yet to go in it, but I have seen pictures on Instagram and their Facebook and it's pretty cute. Probably, I didn't know this was gonna turn into a huge try and haul. It's like a whole separate video in itself. I think these are the ones. Yeah, I think these are cute. And like I said, I don't think it's super fancy. I'm gonna text her really quick and see if she's wearing heels, but even if she is, um, I don't know. I don't know if I want to rock heels tonight, to be honest. I don't know. Nobody's going to see them. Maybe sitting down eating dinner. I do. I don't even know if it's gluten free, though. Rice yeah. Oh, so it probably, it probably is. Thank you. No, thank you. I'm good, thank you. Crazy. They took away your plate. Yep, that's why. Thank you. Leslie! Just going on the vlog. There's so much more on this one. What do you mean? Come here to her. Compared to the online menu? Yeah, they don't have Long Island iced teas on the online menu. Are you ready for drink? Um, not yet. Just a water, but I'm definitely okay. going to get some. Cool. Yes, please. Drink. Um, I don't even know if I've said it yet in this vlog, but most of you probably follow me on my social media, so most of you probably know what tonight is, but if you don't, then keep watching. Okay, I think I'm American Dream and Hollywood will be a great duo. Do you know what you want? You're gonna try the rum again? I'm gonna give it this drink. Thank you. 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 No. Looks like eyeballs. It's really good. It tastes like something I've had. I just don't know what. I think passion fruit, but I don't think I've ever had passion fruit. Is it kind of bland? It's just good. What is that? Orange and grapefruit. Tangerine. Kind of. I thought it would be a darker drink. No. It's probably going to be really strong like vodka. Yeah. Maybe another drink. This fruit juice is in there. It is pretty fruity. Good. It's mild. It's great to like it's such an easy drink. As long as you have the fruit, make in the summer. You can make one with fruit cocktail. Yeah. It's kind of what it tastes like. I wanted to tell you guys, actually. Okay, I'll tell you where we're going. We're going to the Ariana Grande concert, but I'm sure most of you probably already knew that. Um, should I tell them? <laughs> he basically tried to use reverse psychology on me because on Friday morning, mm -hmm. I go, <laughs> I contemplated selling 
the tickets a lot. He was like, do whatever you want with your ticket, but you can't sell mine because I'm still going. <laughs> it worked. That wasn't why I came because of that, but <laughs> you would not have gone by yourself. No. <laughs> Definitely not. I just felt like it was excessive. I don't know. I just feel like it's such a luxury to go tonight, especially when we're like trying to, well, I'm trying to pay down debt and stuff. So, um, that was my main reason for wanting to sell them, but I feel like I would pay that and then some just to see you go by yourself, though. <laughs> Guys, I haven't even washed my hair once since I got a cut. And I know that was in this vlog, but in real life, that was almost three days ago. So, and it still looks so good. It still has the curls and everything in it. Looks so much healthier. At the Saturday? Bottom. Saturday morning. Yeah. Did this come with it or is it separate that side goes that goes with it? Thank you. Okay, enjoy. Thank you. That looks so pretty. You haven't heard me playing them all week? So you said you don't know really any Ariana Grande songs? Uh, mean we got an hour drive. <laughs> no way. Guys, he has a hard time sitting at home and watching the Ellen show because of the girls screaming. I don't know what he thought he signed up for oh, when he bought this. <laughs> Sign up for this. I said what? You said you wanted me to go. Yes, you I bought you were two tickets. Take somebody else. No, I, I wanted think I to, had go. to go. I told you, I just want you to take a day off from work, and I just want to spend time with you. So I figured that's what you wanted when you bought the tickets. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you'll be in Ariana or whatever they call her once this is done. It's like her super fans make an Ariana out of you. This is not Ariana. Stopping home quick to let the pups eat, go out, before we head to <laughs> Hi, boobies. <laughs> Had that ball the whole time, I bet. <laughs> I forgot I didn't put that up. <laughs> While we're doing that, I'll show you guys my outfit underneath this hoodie. It's the same brand as the shirt that I had on last night. What is the brand on this? Live in the moment, yeah. I have the same ones on as yesterday. That's it. And then I ended up going with these that I almost wore last night. This is also from TJ Maxx, so I don't know if you guys would be able to find it, but um, it was $9.99. So, super, super cute. I love this color. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know that this is basically the color of my Instagram. I really, really like this color. We gotta do that again. No, no. And I actually just recorded yes. this. <laughs> so anyways, I had to come on and say, we were just talking. And my cheeks he, said, he said, it's gonna be weird to be at a concert with without everybody around me tripping. And I said, yeah, it's gonna be weird for me too, but just like for the fact that it's a pop concert. And I, the last time I went to a pop concert was Britney Spears when I was like eight years old. And then he said, <laughs> what'd you say, babe? The last pop concert I went to was also Britney Spears when I was <laughs> in high school. <laughs> How long have we been together? Uh, Almost seven so years? I never knew that. Why? Chicks! <laughs> <laughs> now I know why he really wanted
first on Howard Street toward William Street, then turn left onto Lodge Street. <laughs> the GPS lady's still talking to me. <laughs> Ooh, somebody's clone smells good. Oh, I like it. Is this the line?